sine wave fiber viscometer SV10. SV10 is composed of a main unit and a display unit. The main unit and the display unit are connected by a connection cable. The main unit and the display unit have been adjusted as one set. For accurate viscosity measurement, confirm that the main unit and the display unit carry the same serial number before use. The main unit has a stand. The sensor unit is fitted to the stand. The position of the sensor unit is adjustable. Loosen the lever. Support the sensor unit. Pinch and hold the grip. Move the sensor unit. Release the grip and fasten the lever. The sample cup is fixed by guides on the table. Pull out the sample cup toward you. The table is detachable. Take out the screw. And slide the table toward you. The open space is now available for you to put an instrument such as a heating plate or a stirrer according to your needs. The position of the sensor unit can be fitted up to face the opposite direction on the stand for applications involving bigger sample containers or in the process of viscosity measurement. The sensor unit has a temperature sensor that can measure temperatures of between 0 and 100 degrees Celsius or 32 and 212 degrees Fahrenheit. The sensor plates are located on either side of the temperature sensor. The sensor unit has a protection mechanism for the sensor plates and temperature sensor. The protector mechanism is easy to remove for cleaning purposes. To measure a sample, place the sample cup on the table. Push the sample cup into place, held by the guides. Lower the sensor unit. Adjust the fluid surface level to the center of the narrow part of the sensor plates.
The display unit has only six keys for simple and easy operation. Press the on-off key for standby mode. The vacuum fluorescent display is very clear and easy to see to prevent reading errors. Press the start key to begin the measurement. The processing indicators will start to blink. Fifteen seconds later, the viscosity measurement value is displayed. The viscosity and temperature measurements are on a real-time basis. During the measurement, press the hold key to freeze the display temporarily. The hold indicator will appear on the left side of the display. In hold function, the processing indicator blinks to show that measurement is still processing. Press the hold key again to release the hold function and the display shows the viscosity and temperature on a real-time basis again. Press the mode key to change the unit of viscosity between millipascal seconds and pascal seconds. Centipoise and poise can also be selected. Even in hold function, the unit of viscosity displayed can be changed by pressing the mode key. Press stop to end the measurement. The processing indicator disappears. The hold indicator appears and the measurement results are freezed. Press the stop key again and the display goes into standby mode. Press the print key to send the measurement data viscosity and temperature via RS232C. After use of SV10, cleaning is necessary to avoid measurement errors caused by residue from old samples. Any residual sample materials from the protector, sensor plates and temperature sensor should be removed. Hold the sensor plates or temperature sensor with tissue paper. Move the tissue paper downward to remove the residual samples. Gentle handling in this way will not damage the sensors.